Hey. It's day 30. Oh my god. <laughs> Just I do my prayer. <clears throat> But first, we need to have a conversation. It is the last day of this challenge. However, I will continue doing this because I've been having a ton of fun with it. And we're going into this accent because I need to talk to you like I'm your Jewish mother. Listen, Bubba, we need to figure something out. A good 48% of my views are coming from people who aren't even subscribed to my channel. So I have created a challenge for us. Well, for you. Because I can't really subscribe to my own channel because this doesn't really make any sense at all. So here's a clip of a conversation that I had with myself earlier today. Roll it. How can we get our channel to 100 subscribers? Hmm. Well, you know what usually works? Bribery? I, I, I was gonna say incentive, but I mean, that's fine. No, bribery is fine. No, dude, seriously, I don't- But what could we bribe with? Okay, well, uh, what's our best video? Hmm. 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 Dragon. Yes! Jeez! Yes. Oh, we are so in sync. Amazing. Amazing. Love it. Sweet. Perfect. Let's do it. Great. So there it is, folks. You've got a challenge before you. A hundred subscribers. And I will turn this... Oh. This magical dragon into a full-size painting. And I don't just mean, you know, square this off and make it about that size. No, no, no. I mean an 11 by 14 canvas. This is the size of an 11 by 14 canvas. I have seven of them, so if I mess up, I can do it again. Or you can always just cover it up. What else have we learned? So there it is. Can you do it? Can you do it? I know you can do it. But for now, it's the last piece of paper. Do I even- should I do it? Should I do this? Or should I dump it out? This? Dump it out. This. Continuity. Obviously. Oh, I'm gonna drop something. It's Dan's suggestion. For those of you who don't know, Dan is my boyfriend. Hi, babe. And he wants me to do something musically abstract with maybe like clefs or a keyboard from Dan. I, even, I put a little heart by his name. I'm cheesy. What if we did big old treble clef and put a keyboard in the clef? Oh yeah. And something else maybe around it to fill in some, ooh, oh, okay. We're cranking, we're cranking. Let's see what happens. Let's do it. Okay, I'm not using a reference picture. It's the last day. I'm confident I have done 29 other paintings. I'm not using a reference picture. I also know what a piano looks like and I also know what a treble clef looks like. So, given that I want the keyboard keys to be white, I'm going to do the treble clef itself first. Everything that I want in black paint and then fill in the background afterward. I think his favorite color is purple. Usually when I ask him, he says purple, but frequently he also just says, uh, but he does really like purple. So I'm gonna make the background in the purple family, maybe like a, a pale lavender situation. Kind of smoky, kind of pretty, could be nice. And it'll look really nice with some black and white. So let's start uh, sketching out a trail clef. Here we go. <laughs> That looks for now. That looks real nice. I'm very nervous that I'm not gonna get these lines right. So we're gonna do some black ink. I've got the thin liner brush. I'm scared that I'm gonna mess it up, but we're gonna try. Cause this is for Dan. Dang it. Oh God, I'm gonna be obnoxious in this video, aren't I? Am I ever not obnoxious in a video? Yeah, but this time it's cheesy obnoxious. So that's gonna be like 30 times worse. <laughs>
Okay, is this exactly what a piano keyboard is meant to look like? No, but I think it looks kind of freaking nice, man. I'm probably gonna put white here and here um, so it doesn't look like that line is cutting through it because right now this is giving me major scythe vibes. But I think we're in a good spot to mix some purple because yeah. So here's my idea for the background color. Side note, how excited are we to peel this thing? Oh my gosh. We're gonna get the blue. We're gonna get the red. I'm not using my uh, my, my purple purple paint, A, because I'm basically out of it, <laughs> and B, because I want the this style of purple that mixing these two gets me, right? So see how this is like violet, right? It's not that vibrant bright purple. Okay, so we've got that sort of muddy color, but this with some white, more red. <laughs> I'm gonna try adding some pink. Oh, I mean, come on. Ooh, ooh, all right, let's do a little more. Ooh, ah, let's do it. Okay, we have this lovely purple background that needs something else, I'm not sure what. And I need to clearly clean up some of those black lines. But first, we need our final dry time break. I'm gonna use this time to uh, talk about dance. <clears throat> Only a little, I swear. Really, I just wanna say like, I think this is doubly perfect to use for his wedge because it's certainly his instrument of choice. He does have a small keyboard in his apartment and he's very, very good at playing it. I don't know if y'all have ever experienced this, but even if it's not with a significant other, it's just someone important to you. Watching someone you love do the thing that they love is, I mean, in, in this context, it's just kind of hot, but like, it's so fun and absolutely beautiful because you know that, you know that what they're doing is making them so happy. Like, I remember one time I was at Dan's apartment and we like finished a game or something and it didn't go as planned. And so he wasn't feeling fabulous. And he just got up and went over to his keyboard and just like played nothing in particular. He just sort of played something. And I uh, stared at him. <laughs> it's so awesome watching someone do that. So if you find out someone you care about has a hobby, no matter how silly you might think it is, it's really important to them. And you should watch them do that hobby sometime. It's really cool. Back to the time lapse. <laughs> Are you being a people? 
She's on the couch and it's very cute. This is not done. This is not done. Yeah. This is not done. We need like, ooh, different music notes. Yeah, and the dots and the tails have the, the white too. Ooh, great, don't eat the table. smoke it out something I don't know I still have the original color mixed so if I don't like it I can cover it up okay I like it committing I like love it <laughs> Day 30. That's the last day. <laughs> Let's bring it in. Our abstract treble clef. Some other notes, a little smokiness, some keyboard. Yeah. Thanks, Dan. I'm thinking we do the like grand tour of everything tomorrow when I peel the tape and I peel the paint and we have our little grand finale moment. But for now, please hit like, please hit subscribe. I'm not stopping after this video and definitely hit subscribe because if we get to 100 subscribers, I'll paint that big old dragon. And I know you guys like the dragon. I know you like the dragon. Anyway, and if you want to be a part of the challenge, it's just as easy as hitting the button right there. You can watch another video there, and you can catch the playlist that's gonna have all the videos now, literally all 30 days, right there.